Hey y'all, it is my 34th 2017 video journal slash journey, and I am taking it easy this evening. Well, most of the day, actually. Um, and I'm getting ready to watch Ghostbusters, the lady version, so I'm excited, watching it all on my lonesome. Um, anyway... I know I have several messages I've been wanting to share, and I just haven't gotten on at a decent time to do it. So, one thing that happened to me is I got a message from my friend because I sent a funny meme that a different friend sent to me. And it was just hilarious, but it was a little dirty, so I couldn't share it. But anyway, my friend was like, oh, you have a sense of humor. And I said, sometimes... But, oh, and then the reply was, rarely. So, the interesting thing about that is, I have another friend who I laugh every time we have a conversation. It's a very rare occasion that I don't laugh. Unless we're discussing something serious that's going on. I laugh during every conversation. So, the point of me even bringing this up is this. And it goes back to many years of my life and experiences and things. Is that you can have a certain type of personality in general. But when two personalities are combined in a situation in proximity to each other. It can create... A somewhat different personality in one or both of those people some people that you hang around will tend to bring out the best in you and some will tend to bring out the worst in you the purpose I want to talk about this is because it's all about energy um, and how we affect each other's energy it's just kind of like you think of atoms and you put different atoms together and if you put an oxygen atom with a hydrogen atom depending on the number of molecules and what have you, you might come up with water or peroxide or whatever. The point is, when you mix different things together, they cause each other to put on different qualities or traits. It's the same with people. So, be very mindful about the types of people that you hang around. Pay attention to... The type of person you become when you are around them because there is really something to that it's just it's not just random um, so stay around people who keep you um, light-hearted and not sullen and um, I mean if it's just an occasional uh, freak moment like maybe somebody's having a bad day so they rub you a wrong way that's one thing but if you're around certain individuals on a regular basis and it causes you to feel a certain way or kind of change your predominant behavior, um, negative or positive, just pay attention to those things and make sure you're surrounding yourself with the ones that are bringing out the positive in you um, and not the negative. And always, always, always keep your energies high, keep your vibration high. Um, try to always remain in peace and love because those are the highest vibrations. And gratitude is also a very high vibration. So, anyway, I ended up talking a lot longer than I had planned to. I'm going to do a few exercises and some yoga. And then I'm going to watch a movie. Or I may do a few exercises, then watch a movie, and then do yoga. That's probably how I'll do it. So, I'm sending out love, light, and healing energy. Ask that you please pass it on. And until tomorrow, rest well, y'all. Have a good evening.